So right here from the comfort of my kitchen, I can tell you how important it is to observe the still life before you get started. And today, for your amazement, I have a very special surprise guest, my mother Michi. Michi, who has been great for my ratings and Facebook um, engagement. Allo Michi. Allo. Comment ça va? Um, ça va comme ci, comme ça. D'accord. Alors ici, on est là pour un tutoriel d'art. We're here for an art tutorial. This is a still life done for six minutes, then the same one for four and two. Mm -hmm. So the idea is to draw the same thing faster and faster. Mm -hmm. What do you think about that? Um, I think that uh, you've been here since uh, last January. And now I think that yesterday you bought your return ticket for August 20th. 21st. 21st, like in three weeks. And I have two offers to get picked up at the airport, which I'm excited about. But it's going to be not easy <clears throat> on this side of the country to uh, see you leave because we've been through the whole pandemic together since before it started. Well, it was started, but we didn't know. Um, and uh, the future is uh, uncertain. Uncertain. We Uncertain. will need a lamp, a lamp. Yeah, an oil lamp. And you can see in the middle that vertical plumb line, which is really helping me uh, to give that symmetry across. Mm -hmm. And this is the blocking of the form. So this exercise is very good to teach um, simplification and plotting out the drawing early on and some of the mistakes that you have in this stage you're going to want to go with and call it style but more about my uh, what's it called a sojourn sojourn my sojourn in Montreal mm -hmm. we've been singing a lot of sacred harp mm -hmm. this one week we sang with our friends um, every day of the week we were the everyday thing. It seems like, like so long ago. Ça fait longtemps. Oui. The, the fabric of the time. Space time. Has changed a lot. Ingrid. <laughs> like we are in a time space or space time that we've never experienced before. No. There's mm. a fracture. There's a fracture. Yes. For sure. Yeah, so now what's the... It's a cup. There's... Yeah. Yeah. Broad lines are more forgiving. They are. And Michelle, do you know what negative space is? Um, it's the space like... Here. Yeah. Exactly. Like... That's a negative and also, space. And also here. All yeah. the background. Yeah. But when it's enclosed, like Michelle's elbow, it's a different category. I call it enclosed negative shape. Mm. That's a oil lamp that I received as a wedding gift in 1981. You're very careful with your things. Yes, I am. But I think I broke the globe. Understandable. And Fair. I replaced it once, I think. So we're still on the first drawing. I really insist on real-time drawing to um, have a little bit more of a tactile experience watching it. What's that piece? That's a kiwi. The, no. The seashell? Oh, it's a seashell. Yeah. Okay. The, draw the drawings actually get better as they get shorter. So, a very good memory exercise to trust yourself. Mm. And you've told me from my drawings that I like to get in shading a little bit too quickly for your... What about this in this case? Yeah. 
a little bit too quickly. Yeah. No, no. No? You, what I don't like is when you go... <laughs> 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 Like all of a sudden, you just like go. It's very jarring. It's my postmodern commentary on the futility of art in an, an overpopulated planet. On and over. Futility of everything. True. Futility of life. Not the CERN. Everybody loves the CERN. What's that? The Large Hadron Collider. Oh, everybody loves the CERN. <laughs> What are you talking about? I'm not sure. I think I've lost. I've finally lost it. Okay, so that handle, you know, going over the lines, and this is what something that's that I try to impress on my students is to learn to go over their lines, and you can even see that little over. Oh, like, oh, it's gone. Yeah. Now this is the four minute drawing. Same thing, for four minutes. Okay. The other one was six. Six minutes. Mm hmm so you can see there's a little bit of magic here and nervous um, gesture Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh my goodness <laughs> riveting Ooh, yeah I'm so riveted exactly mm. I love it this is so much fun doing the this video with you I really appreciate the now well I was not uh, I did not receive advance notice no. no no off the cuff yes that's what it is yeah like uh seven minutes ago i didn't know mm -hmm. about this you know something really trippy that i realized <coughs> making live fitness videos mm -mm. so when i have a group in front of me and we do the left side um i do my right side and i call it the left side mm-hmm but here, like in the video, this is really the right side for everybody. So although you're seeing my face, in the virtual space, we're all facing the same way. And you're seeing my back. So you think you see my face, but you're seeing my back. Uh, repeat after me. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, like a mirror, like I'm a, this video is a mirror. It's not me. If it was me. My right, oh. would, my left would be here. Mm, no. But it's here. Do you know? If you say so. Come on, come on. There's only four minutes. Go, go. I know. There's nothing like disappointing one's mother. Nothing quite as heartachey. Oof. So do you think um, that because I'm going too slow, it makes it a bit boring? Boring. Is it boring? Uh, am I bored? Is it boring? Yeah. Uh, it's like a very difficult question. It's a slow day. It's gray. The heat is less than it was. We've had six heat wave and we're not even at the end of July. Am I bored? This is one part I really like how the, the, uh, the glass, the globe you called it, how it's um, the weight of the line is not even. Mm -hmm. So that it really does create a lot of interest and in having done the trip. So I didn't look at the drawing for a while and then I came back to the drawing and I was not bored. Huh? That's a good sign. But we're almost four minutes. Yeah, we're almost done with the drawing. Well, it's not easy having a shaky easel. I know you. Sh I shouldn't blame no one but me, but to get a good angle with the camera it's hard to do on a wall i guess i could like this is artificial lighting mm -hmm. so this one is better i do think so it the 
the base of the lamp is less squished or it's still very it's, uneven. It's just more live, lively. Lively. Yeah. Yeah. It's, not, it's just more interesting. Yeah. And this is the last one. So this is almost the end of our video, everyone. I know you're going to mess up. That us. looks like a milk, milk, milk bottle. Yeah. Ah, and that looks like an ear. Yeah. Yeah. Well, two minutes, right? So no time to fuss about, as they would say in Britain. No fussing. No fussing about. No. But isn't it funny? Like, without the time constraint, that this never comes out. It's true. So true. So true. So, so true. Michelle likes to say art is you. It's you even when you're not drawing. It's, how it's you... life. It's the way you live your life. We were taking a flamenco class and then she did this and our teacher had the chill. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to stink you up. <laughs> Do it. No, no, no. <laughs> All right. So the kiwi is a lot more proportionate, a lot closer to the edge of the lamp. Proportioned. Proportionate. Proportionized, darling. Proportionate. Proportionate. It's proportionized. Oh my god. Yeah. See a lot more um, <laughs> going on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Very different from the original mm. lines. Sex. Is that one okay? 